Hey everyone, I'm Mindy from Cute Girls Hairstyles, and today Brooklyn's gonna help me out from Brooklyn and Bailey. Hi guys. And we're gonna show you how to do the running braid combo. So I saw this picture pop up in my Instagram feed from Lululemon, and you guys are always asking me for um, hairstyles that you can wear if you're doing athletics, you know, that are still cute but pulled back and out of your face. So this one I knew needed a tutorial, so we're gonna film this one for you guys today. So we have just started by, Brooklyn washed her hair and slept on it last night so that it was nice and clean, but we haven't done anything with it. And I'm gonna begin a regular French braid right here at the top, right at the, just at the top of her forehead. And I'm gonna, just to begin, we're gonna run a basic French braid down the top of her head. And we are gonna pick up hair all the way pretty much to her ears. So this is pretty basic. French braid. You could even do a Dutch braid if you really wanted to, if that's the one you're more comfortable with, and a French braid. That's fine too. Now I'm going to continue the braid all the way down, as just all the way to the very end. Get a piece of hair out of there. And when I get to the end, I'm going to secure it with an elastic. And just for the sake of doing my next step, I'm going to take this and just flip it up and over so it's out of the way. Now I'm going to take the rest of her hair and I'm going to pull it up into a ponytail right where the braid ends. So you can just use a comb, you can use some water or some hairspray if you need to. On Brooklyn, she has like a lot of little fuzzies, so I'm actually gonna just spritz a little bit of hair wax through it to help kind of tame some of that flyaway issue for her. Okay, and when you have that pulled where you pretty much want it, then I'm gonna add this hair back in and secure it all together in one ponytail elastic. Make sure you have all your pieces where you want them laying. Into a nice high ponytail. Oh, she's got so much hair. <laughs> really good. I know that elastic was tight too. Oh. Okay, so now we have the one braid and the remaining hair. I'm gonna take the braid again and flip it on top and I'm gonna divide the rest of this section of hair into three pieces, just pretty much even pieces sure and then you're going to braid each of those sections when you're done braiding those three sections go ahead and pull that fourth braid back down in and I'm just going to split two braids in my right hand and two braids in my left and I'm going to just take them and twist them together all the way down and then when you get to the end, secure it with an elastic all together. And then, ooh, that elastic did not last. My hair's too thick. <laughs> secure them all together. And then you can even go back and pull out the others if you'd like, since you have it nicely secured together now. And then just let it loosen up a bit and sit like this. And you have the running braid. Let's do a final spin. It's just a great little French braid into a ponytail of braids. Would you wear that to your dance class? Before? Definitely. She has dance it, every day at school this it year. It would stay in really well and be perfect. Keep it out of your face yeah. anyway. Mm -hmm. And if you're all sweaty or gross. It doesn't look that bad because it's in a ponytail. That's right. Perfect. Okay, so if you guys want to see some really old pictures, of Brooklyn and our hairstyles. Be sure to check us out on Facebook. Be sure to give us a like over there. And we'll follow them. Follow yeah. them on Facebook. We'll put a link in the description box below. You can find it at Cute Girls Hairstyles, of course. And we will see you guys next Sunday. Bye, you guys. Bye.
Wait, tell me what you're so excited about. School. Your first day of preschool, right now. Are we going right now? Okay, mm -hmm. let's go. Yay. Hi, Kat.